Black Compass, Black Compass Media. Salute to everybody tuning in, everybody in the building. Um, whew, where do we begin? What a and what a movie this weekend was. Like this weekend was a movie, and when I say movie, I mean a bad movie. Like <laughs> if we being honest. Um, number one, where do we start, man? Let's start. Fuck it. Let's start here. Uh, Panic Room, man. Queen of the Rings. Salute to Debo. Salute to Baps. Uh, Vague, man. Salute to everybody on the team. Yeah, this this really ain't on y'all, man. Y'all did the best y'all could do. I, like I said, when 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 I do these recaps, um, a lot of the times it don't it don't really be the leagues. Like the leagues do all. You know they put well. From what I from what I know, I don't know the behind the scenes details a lot of this for this card. But for what I know, you know the league did their thing. Forty. 40 bars, let me explain something to you. What you did this weekend, the the same like I, the same thing we do for twerk, we gotta we do for for anybody that no show, we gotta kinda do it. Like this is crazy. Yo, first and foremost, I was in the building. A lot of people drove really far to see you perform 40. Not only you the coffee, salute the coffee. Coffee was actually there in the building. She was doing her thing, she showed up, she did everything she was supposed to do. Um it really like she did her part she was in the building she was there she was interacting with the fans she was ready hey listen i'm about to perform stay around she did everything she was supposed to do um 40 what the hell 40 like first and foremost let, let's 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 go through the list of rumors that they saying that um they saying that uh that that one of the reasons you didn't perform this is what i'm hearing one of the reasons you didn't perform um, was that you had you planned on bringing hustle out in your third round and coffee bent hustle so that's why you you know without that third you didn't have a third and you didn't want to change eh. yeah 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 whatever fam if that's true for you a legend you should be able to improvise you should be able to you should be able to to to, to easily you you're known for like 40 you're, you're kind of like one of the battle rappers that's known for writing magical rounds in, in short periods of time so that that don't I, I, i'm not that's not flying like yeah, yeah whatever fam mm -mm. I, I don't know what's your reasoning to not battling coffee i like and then if you knew your shit was shaky why did you the day before go on a crazy promo run like how you did with qb and making the fans more anticipated for this match come on what are we doing 40 You looking a little shaky. I ain't gonna lie, Forty. You looking a little shaky. If you ask me, you look a little scary. If you ask me, I'm just being honest. She's looking a little weird. It's looking crazy. I'm just, just being real. I can only I, I, I can only be myself. I can't be nobody else, man. I'm being real. You look this this look crazy. And Coffee says she's not battling you no more. So there goes that one. That one is straight out the window. Um. Wow. So you lost potentially. I mean, you never know how that thing go. But I know Coffee is a pretty headstrong individual. So if she say some shit, she going nine times out of ten, she's sticking by it. And that's just how it's going to be. BlackCompassMerch.com. Shameless plug, man. We got the mask out. They out. This how they look. I will put it on my face, but I'm, I don't feel like it. Uh, pause. Only a strong salute. You know what I mean? Some, some shit. You know what I mean? Ross clothing line. Anyway, um, so now back to... 40 i just feel like 40 um this wasn't a good look if we being honest this this wasn't a good look at all this this honestly took the energy out the card it's like it, it's a slap in the face the queen of the ring man I, if I, and i told debo I, and it's not and it's no shade that coffee or anybody because y'all you know you showed up but i just think debo is in a position i just think queen of the ring is in a position where they should focus on a newer talent and bringing them up, man. You got the Hope Trillies. You got the Eliza Versus. There's a lot of dope women out there. You know what I mean? And it's like, to avoid these situations, because, you know, a lot of the old... If 40 did back out because she felt Hustle wasn't in there, I just felt like, you know, it's it's time to bring new talent, man. It's time to build time to build new talent, man. Battle rap, you know, it, it is what it is, man. Less trouble. It's always, it seems like it's always something that Queen of the Ring, man. It's always some type of shit, man. Um... It was drama outside. I didn't, I didn't, you know me, when I, listen, man, if I'm not doing interviews, if I'm not, if we not doing anything, I'm not hanging out outside around after event afterwards, man, so I don't really be saying shit like that. I mean, I'm usually tired from 
inside I actually you know we do real media we go in there we take pictures and videos interview all that shit so by the time I get outside I'm ready to go home and I don't, I don't got time to sit and chill so I ain't really even see that and plus I ain't go front the building was pissed off like the 40 no 40 coffee like that that that's crazy son like that, that set the tone for the weekend now you know every time a nigga cough nigga just Um, next, who do we have now? Let's let's get. I, I don't know why I feel like I'm in Houston, but I'm really in Atlanta. Um, this is this is an on the road recap. I just had to just wanted to get my thoughts out there before I forget. Through the bar, got show coming this week. Before I forget that. Um, yeah, man. So let's get to it, man. Atlanta. We 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 here in Atlanta now. Um, uh, I got got on the radar. I got to Atlanta. Um, you know me, salute the cola, salute the Henny TV, everybody dug the boss, everybody we seen. Um, Greedy Gotti finally make Greedy Yo, my nigga Greedy Gotti look had the Aladdin shoes on. Like my nigga Greedy Gotti, he a cool little white man, man. He white, you white as shit though, but you cool. I like Greedy. Um now, get to the event. Event was cool, salute to Beasley. Debo, of course, Debo always show the most love, man. Salute to Debo the highest. Salute to Debo, man, the highest of all salutes. Um, salute to BZ again, salute to Smack, everybody. Now, get to the event, though. They used the old MC War event. Um, they used the old MC War, uh, MC MC Battle League, uh, whatever whatever the car was that um, Charlie Clips and Big K Battle on. They used that arena. So they just took the ring out, and they made it like a stage. It was a pretty dope arena, center stage. It was pretty, pretty, pretty fire. I ain't gonna front. Now... What could I say? Overall, I ain't going to front. I'm going to keep it all the way up. Being with you all the way a stack. The energy of the building was was amazing. The energy was fire. Um, I felt like... Um, I'm not going to lie, man. It's hard for me to give a real recap, man. Y'all know what's up, man. Surf, Cortez did not go down. Um, in the building, they said... I ain't going to front. There was a lot going on in the building. Oh, it was a lot, a lot going on. Uh, good. It was a lot of good though. Not mainly bad. It was a lot of good. But Surf Cortez didn't happen. Um, apparently a fan seen. Uh, apparently a fan ran down on Surf. Said something um to him in regards to a spaces convo. I think he put his hands on Surf if I'm not mistaken, which led to Surf people stepping in. You know, protecting the artists, which led to. Allegedly, you know, whatever, whatever. You seen the pictures? The pictures look, they look disgusting. Like, dude took a whole chunk out of a uh, surf man's shoulder. That's you lucky. That's to be honest with you, you lucky he got out of there with a with an ass whipping. If we keeping it all the way up in with you, he he's he's very lucky to have his life. Like for real, if we if we being honest, that that's kind of that that's kind of crazy. That that one was a little bit crazy. Um. What's going on with these battle rap events, man? I just feel like, I, I don't know, man. I, I can't explain it. I just feel like we in this, the spaces ever, like, I feel like with spaces, not to blame spaces, because I'm one of the people that, you know, was benefiting off of spaces when it came out and all that stuff. It's, it's still a good way to interact with people. It's, it's always going to be good. It's, don't, it's, but it's also too much interaction leads to a situation like this. Like, too much fan in it. And I hate the word fan. Support in it, whatever, you know. Support a fan, whatever you want to call it. Too much of that interaction, I feel like, with the wrong kind. Like, it's, it's amazing supporters. You got supporters. Like, we got some of the Black Compass Media. I can honestly say we got, and I, I have multiple businesses. I can honestly say we have some of the best supporters, period. Like, with just anything. Like, y'all got supporters. Y'all leave comments in person. So, I, I understand. Like, I'm grateful but it's, it's supporters out there that that's just a little too extra. You know what I mean? So I just feel like it was a situation hard and so You know where I'm at. I'm in the airport. You know, I'm always on the plane shortly. doing what it do. Currently, there is a delay posted for this. Hard oh. and so for the delay. We back. Um, I just feel like with the, uh, with the spaces, I just feel like when you make yourself super accessible, this is what happens. Like, fans feel like they, they know you. They feel like they next to you. They feel like they close to you. And... This, this could result in that, man. Fan might have heard you in spaces and might have tapped, you know what I mean, felt comfortable enough to talk to you all day long 
and then see you in person, it felt like it was the same energy, not realizing, like, like yo, spaces is spaces. This is real life. Like, I think, I just feel like people have a hard, especially this generation. Like, I just feel like, and not even this generation, like, like old. I just feel like the mindset of the generation that's being put in, the, installed in the people brain, young, old, because your brain can be rewritten. I just feel like it, it is that, man. I just feel like we, 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 we live in a time which is people just feel they don't know how to separate the internet from real life and it could result in a situation like this. And these kind of situations are going to keep happening. They're going to keep happening until we, you know what I mean? We got to figure out a, a proper medium. And y'all got to remember, this is our culture. Like at the end of the day, this is our culture. Before, before even when battle rap is on the, the highest scale of highs, the Madison Square Gardens is the staple centers of the world. Not staple center, the crypt, the crypt center, crypto center. Um, and so on and so forth, Mercedes-Benz Stadium, so on and so forth. When it gets to these type level, we just remember we were the blueprint for it. So we got to kind of start moving like that, man. We got to kind of, I don't know how, we'll, I, don't, I don't know what we could do, man. This, this was a really shitty weekend for Battle Rap. Like, like this, this was like a really bad weekend for Battle Rap. Like, I, and I, I get people, everybody excited. They're getting to see each other. They get, they get to see all their spaces friends. They get to see all their internet friends. They get to see people they ain't seen in a while. So... But this this was a bad look. Like this is this was supposed to be a heavy hit and weekend, man. Like you you had the um, I mean you, you had the forty coffee was supposed to set the tone for the weekend. I was supposed to have the women on edge. That was supposed to have just everything moving. And then you got Surf Cortez, the grudge of all grudge matches. Like what are we doing right now? Why didn't that happen? This, I, I don't know, man. Um, I'm a, on a scale from one to ten. I ain't gonna front. It's hard for me to even recap because I'm just, I'm just like, I know personally a lot of people that flew in, that that road drove from where they were drawing to see 40 and coffee, and I know a lot of people that's them same people turned around to go to Atlanta to see Surf vs Cortez, and they didn't get to see any of them. And not for nothing, I'm one of the people, so it's like, eh, that that's just up. Like, eh, it, it wasn't. I don't know. that This this was a shitty weekend. Like, I ain't gonna lie. Shitty battle rap weekend. But everything else was cool, though. Um, The energy in the building pff, for that certain... After Charlie Eclipse, Ch Ch Calico, man. Calico went crazy, man. That was an all-time... That was one of the best Calicos we have ever seen. That was one of the best Charlie Clips we've seen in a long time. That was one of the best abs we've seen in a long time. Like, I... The, 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 the surf Cortez would have took that shit to the next level, man. And, I mean, at this point, ah, is it going to happen? If it happens, is it if it is it worth it? Do y'all still want to see it? I mean, they got to figure out a way to at least the people that pay. There was a lot of people in the building that just came to see respectfully that the battle was watching. There's a lot of people in the building that mainly came to see surf versus Cortez. Let's be honest. And that didn't happen. That was, that was like a slap in the face. And also, man, I feel like um, the security guards at these venues, man, I feel like caffeine. Listen, man, y'all, you know, y'all net worth is on the Internet. Y'all net worth is on the Internet. I feel like y'all, y'all, you know I mean, y'all should step it up. Y'all should hire a little better security, man. It's just kind of getting crazy now. You had the shit pop off. Granted, with the snake, you had a whole, you know what I mean? The snake eye situation, that, stuff, that popped off. That was that was another situation. Okay, that was an outside, isolated event. Now you now you got this going on. Like, it, it, I just feel like you just maybe have to just beef up the security. Or maybe y'all just going to have to just start making the areas that's for battlers and managers and media. Y'all should just start making it just for that. Because the dude that, that, that was on the floor... That um, allegedly did what he did to serve homie. Um, I seen him on stage multiple times, so he wasn't like a random fan, or he could have been. But why is he on stage? Why is he backstage? Why is he near people? Like I just feel like we got to get back to setting some type of guidelines to these events. Like media should be here, you know, fans should be here, managers should be here. Like you gotta kind of run it like a real hip hop event. Like if you if you ever like um I I you know I covered a lot of hip hop events over my life. I've been on a lot of shows backstage or a lot of shit. Um, had the privilege of seeing a lot of artists perform before they even broke out and became who they are today. 
um, should, uh, you know, I, I could name, I could go on for days and just name names. A lot of shows, a lot of just, you know, different shit. And the one, the common thing these places have is they have like organization down pack. Like random Joe Smo is not going to make it in the back with us. Like not, um, I just feel like they got to do a better job of separating they got to do a better job of separating and organizing. Like, a random Joe Smo is not supposed to be able to make it to the back anywhere. And I just feel like y'all got to start doing that. Like, y'all got, you, you know, I just, period. I just feel like, and I'm not saying that it, for me because, I mean, I'm on stage all the time, but I'm not just saying that for me. I'm just saying that for the safety of the artists. Like, I, I noticed on the stage there was a lot of random people. And I've never seen that before. You know what I mean? Now, who's to say who's random or not? But let's be honest. Like, I just feel like that's part of the issue. Like, yeah, number one, the battlers are super accessible. Y'all be in spaces all 24-7 day long talking to anybody and any and everybody. Y'all never seen a movie, Selena? Y'all never seen a movie with Bruce Willis? Die Hard. Oh, what was that movie, Bruce Willis? It was a really good movie, Bruce Willis. It was a fan. He was obsessed with the dude. He wanted to. Kill. Anyway, if you if you you never seen that movie, I like. I just feel like we gotta. I just feel like you know, as the bigger this get, you know, because that that shit could have been really unfortunate. Like, say they killed Buddy. Like, let's just say, say Buddy ended up dying there. What what happens? Like, I just I just I don't I don't know, man. This was a very unfortunate weekend for battle rap. Um. I ain't gonna front though. The battles we did get on any given Sunday were really good though. Like I say all that to say they, they were still really good though. Um Eliza Versa, Hope Trilly. It was a cool battle, man. Um Hope Trilly did a thing. I kinda had Hope Trilly in that one. Um Eliza was still fired though. They both was actually really fired for short notice, so I can't really judge that one too bad. They both did good. It's it's two one either way. Um man, I'm just I'm uh, I'm just I'm just you know, it's just it's just it's a shitty. Nah, and then the final thing, man, Will Smith, just to top it off, this happened live at the event, so while, while I'm trying to process the information that's going on with um, the information that's going on with Will Smith, I mean, the information that's going on with Surfing Cortez, a, a viral video comes out, and uh, Will Smith and Chris Rock. Yo, he smacked the dog out this nigga, man. It's just crazy. Could you imagine being a thousand person to tell a joke about a nigga wife and getting smacked for it? Like, that's crazy. Um, That's, I, I, it's two sides of the story. Like, number one, I feel like, you know, you got to defend your wife, you know, if your wife's uncomfortable. But I just feel like at the Oscars, if, this award that barely give black people any kind of recognition, recognition uh, that gives black people any type of acknowledgement that really gives black people any kind of acknowledgement. That's what y'all, you know what I mean? Y'all pick to do that. Like, it's y'all complain about it all the time. Why, why this person not nominated for Oscar? Why this person not nominated for Oscar? But then when you when y'all in the position to do something, you know what I mean? This, this, like, come on. I just feel like, well, come on, man. It's Chris Rock. He a comedian, dude. Stop being so fucking sensitive, man. That's your wife. She did what she's supposed to do. He's a comedian. You have to ask her. You talk to him behind the stage. You could have hollered at Chris Rock. Yo, you're Will Smith. You could highlight at Chris Rock. Yo, listen. Yo, let me holler at you real quick. Let me talk to you in the back. Let's go outside real quick. Come on. You embarrassed that man for what? Because you ain't... <laughs> you ain't embarrassed August so Steam. Y'all just got him deleted off the internet. Y'all didn't embarrass him. Y'all didn't do nothing to him. He, he was doing interviews, making songs. One of my favorite songs, Round Here by August Austin. Go check that out. <laughs> he, he, was, he was talking the shit on there. But um, overall, man, Black Compass Media, the Ball Guy Show will be returning tomorrow. Um, let me get back when I get back. Uh, yeah, man, listen, man, I'm, I'm just... I'm bummed out, man. This is a shitty. This is a shitty situation, shitty event. Well, shitty situation. The event wasn't really too bad, to be honest with you. It's just that situation kind of sent it up. No main events. So we had a week in the battle rap with no main events. That's gonna be the caption. A week in 
of Battle Rap. No main event happened. What the F? I'm out of here. Black Compass, Black Compass Media, salute.